Hey guys, it's The Average Joe here. Got another video for you today. <clears throat> it's an interesting one. Um, it's uh, something that I've been curious about for a while now. Um, just a reminder, I do have a giveaway going on right now. I'll link the video for that down below. Uh, if you like uh, my content, please subscribe, hit the bell notification, like the videos. Um, but yeah, so what I have right here is the D brand, uh, a D brand skin, um, the MKBHD skin, the the silicone colorway that's been discontinued, but I got this when it first came out, and I got it with the D brand grip case, and as you guys saw in my video with the, about the D brand grip case, I'll link that below as well. I was not a fan of that case, but I did love the skin, so I didn't want to, so I returned the case, but I wanted to keep the skin, so thought to myself what do I do with the skin and I figured why not see if this will work on any other case so I have three different cases here I have the the phone rebel uh, the peel case uh, the I believe this is the totally case um, yeah the totally case and I have this clear case um, I have done video reviews of these two. I'll leave those links below as well. But I wanted to see, will this skin fit on the back of these three? So that's what I'm gonna do today. I'm gonna kind of test them out. So uh, I know for a fact that any slim case, like this is a totally case, uh, any you can get any generic slim, thin, like 0.3 millimeter case or whatever they are and 100% it will fit, fit on this. So I'm gonna take the skin and just kind of wipe this down, get get some of the dust off of it. And I'm gonna show you guys what I'm talking about. So everything about these thin cases um, line up pretty well. So bam, there you go. It's on the thin case. Um, the camera cutouts cut out kind of matches really well. Um, even the borders, everything looks good. Um, so you can actually skin these cases uh, with a D brand grip uh, skin case if you want, and it'll work well. So just get any D brand grips, uh, grip skin for your iPhone and that'll work. Now, the reason why I don't like the skin, the D brand grip case is because the MagSafe is horrible. So let's try this one. Um, I believe this one's gonna be a little tough because I think the one thing you wanna look at when you look at uh, cases for your D-brand skin is a camera cutout. Now this one is elevated pretty high and it's also kind of wide. And you'll see right here how there's a little separation in the TPU, that little angle there. Um, but I'm gonna try it anyway, uh, but I do feel like it's not gonna work. So ideally you wanna get a case where the back is as flat as possible. Uh, and that way um, it'll work. So I think for this, what you would probably have to do if you want this to work is get a hair dryer, heat this area up and kind of mold it to the camera bump and it should look good. And yeah, that's actually not bad. So you can kind of get a clear case, put a skin on the back of it. Obviously it's not gonna look pretty uh, attractive from the inside, but surprisingly that fit pretty well. So I'm gonna peel this off now. And I'm gonna take this case, the Phone Rebel now. Uh, in my review of this, I believe I like this better as the number one phone over the D-Brand Grip and the Mouse Limitless 4.0 because it has the strongest magnets and it has the best, uh, well, it doesn't have the best grip. The grip, the D-Brand Grip wins when it comes to grip, but since the D-Brand Grip's magnets are so weak, uh, this is the best, I guess, mill ground. Um, so my concern with this case now is it's got the raised corners. Um, if you look, if you look right here, uh, they're kind of raised. So I feel like it's gonna cut the skin off a little short. So there might be some creasing or whatnot, but I'm gonna try it anyway. So I have it on and what do you know? kind of fits perfectly 
Um, obviously, you see here, it's bending around the corners and the sides, which, I don't know. It's up to you, personal preference, if you can live with that. Uh, you see right there, it gets caught and it bends there. And then the camera cutout is okay. Um, but you'll see here um, where the, there's two different textures, right? You have the carbon fiber and then you have the regular TPU where that meets. You'll, pro you'll obviously get um, a line right there. Mouse case will be similar. So this surprisingly is better than I thought. And I'm happy because as much as I love the dbrand grip case, and the idea of being able to skin my phones, uh, my cases, uh, because honestly, as much as I love this case, I'm not a big fan of carbon fiber. So if I could, I would rather buy a skin and just put something on the back that I like. And this seems to work pretty all right for me. I don't know about you guys, but it's great news to know that there is an option for these kind of cases. The best kind of case you want to get is obviously a phone case where the back is as flat as possible. Um, so, yeah, guys, this is great news. You don't have to be stuck to the D-brand grip case to skin your case. You can actually just buy a decently flat case that, that where the back is flat and slap a skin on it and you'll be good. Anyway, again, thanks guys, thanks guys for all the support and checking out my videos. Uh, again, we got a... Uh, a giveaway going on. I'll link the video below. Take it easy.